Praise the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Though there is lockdown, though there is restriction of movements, social distancing, no matter how much they thought that they are disconnecting us from one another, we are connecting with you. Glory. You are connecting with us. Praise God. Hallelujah. And God has given us a very awesome opportunity to study the word and be inspired. Today is the third day of March. And the word of God that's coming to us today says, The word in, in your, your spirit. spirit. Praise God. Hallelujah. Would you give us a prayer, please? Oh, Father, in the name of Jesus, we worship you. Hallelujah. We exalt you. Hallelujah. We love you more today, yes, more than ever before. We Hallelujah. keep loving you again and again. We thank you for your word that keeps coming to our spirits, yes, strengthening us, yes, enabling Lord. us, yes, energizing Lord. us. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, for the great future that you have in store for Hallelujah. us. Thank you. We receive that word again today. Yes, the Lord. word of your grace. Yes, the word which is able to build us up and yes, give Lord. us an inheritance yes, amongst Lord. all them that are sanctified. Yes, thank you for that word. Thank we receive Lord. it yes. with joy and with gladness. Oh, yes. We mix it with faith oh, yes. and with meekness. Oh, yes. And we thank you because at the end of our study, we will be transformed. Amen. We will be blessed. Amen. We will be improved. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Wow. We have just started another praying and fasting season. Things are changing in the realms of the spirits. Hallelujah. Our Bible test is from the book of Ephesians chapter 6 verse 17. And I read and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit which is the word of God Amen. and that lovely pastor says here 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 3 says for though we walk in the flesh we do not war after the flesh we are not into a physical battle it's spiritual and our weapon is the word of God the sword of the spirit. As you release God's word, the realm of God, you are getting on the offensive in the realm of the spirit. Power is released that shatters the enemy. This is the reason for meditation. Amen. God's word is powerful in your mouth. Hallelujah. After meditation, viracious meditation, during this kind of meditation, your whole attention is on the word. Mm -hmm. You allow no distraction whatsoever. Mm -hmm. This is what makes the difference between someone that's quoting scriptures from the head and someone that's quoting scriptures because it has become resident inside him. This was what distinguished David from the rest of the Israelites. Mm -hmm. They were all circumcised and knew about the covenant, but they trembled before Goliath. Mm -hmm. None of them could face the giant. Hallelujah. Wow. Praise God. Hallelujah. So, so, so inspiring. But when David showed up, he wondered why everybody was afraid of Goliath and said, Who is this uncircumcised Philistine that he should defy the armies of the living God? 1 Samuel chapter 17, verse 26. He was saying, We are circumcised. And by circumcision, we are in league with God. <laughs> but this guy is uncircumcised. He doesn't have God on his side. The circumcision meant something to David that others didn't know about. Wow. That's what happens when the word is in your spirit. Jesus said, out of your belly shall flow rivers, gushers, floods of living water. John chapter 7 verse 38. Colossians 3 16 says, let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. Become voracious in your study of and meditation on the word. Mm. Have the word in your heart and in your mouth. It will make you a wonder and give you the winning mentality. Praise, Praise God. God. I'm a, I'm a success. I'm more than conquerors. I'm, more than I'm a master in this I'm life. In this the, world is ours. the world is ours. We are laying up gold as us. Glory, gold hallelujah. These are our meditation. These are meditation. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. God is with you. Amen. 
the Holy Spirit is with you. Amen. Praise God. Jesus said, the words that I speak, they are spirit and they are life. Hallelujah. So the word of God is in your spirit. Amen. I'd like us to take the confession together as our culture. I would like you to put your hand on your chest and say after me. From my innermost being, from my innermost being, flow, flow, gushers of living water, gushers of living water. As I meditate and receive, as I meditate and receive the word gladly into my spirit, the word gladly into my spirit, it brings forth righteousness, it brings forth righteousness, wisdom, wisdom, and revelation, and revelation, prosperity, prosperity, victory, victory, and abundance, and abundance. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. <laughs> Sickness is far from you. Amen. Failure is far from Amen. you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Those are the words of the Spirit. We're going to see you tomorrow, the 31st of March. Until we see you tomorrow, remember that Jesus Christ is Lord. Hooray.